Hey guys, it's me again. I'm back here and I'm going to show you what to do while you are sitting in your little cabin at night. Now this is something that you should generally not do, but if you're just starting off, it's not a bad idea because you're not too far underground. You usually do not want to dig directly beneath yourself. And so we're going to do it in a method that makes a now in this staircase making method we're going to start a mine so that we can get some resources and better our community. Ah, forgot to make a pickaxe. We go back down. Mining is the pretty much the only boring thing about this game. It takes time, it's just very time consuming, but also very necessary. With coal, you will get something that you need to make well, actually, coal is one of the two vital ingredients of making a torch, which will put off light, which makes mining very, very easy. Well, actually, it doesn't change, my, change much about the mine. It makes seeing while you're mining very, very easy. So let's just go ahead and wipe this out. This is a very large deposit of coal. Alright. Looks like we got it all. Let's, just Let's go back up our magical spiral staircase. See what sort of trouble we can get into. Now the recipe for a torch is very complicated, you ready? Put a stick on the bottom, a piece of coal on top, and just like that you've made the most complicated item in the game. I hope we all recognize that as sarcasm. Now, <coughs> I hate using wooden tools because they are very slow and l just make everything not very quick. So, we're going to upgrade to a stone pickaxe. But you can do this as late as you want to or as early as you want to. And just like this. Oh, look, I missed some. This is why you need light. Because you can miss stuff like diamonds if you're down low enough. And you do. And missing diamonds is a very, very bad thing. So, now I'm going to show you how to set up a strip mine which helps you gather the maximum amount of resources with the least scattered amount of mining. Now, what you want to do is you want to you're going to have a system of tunnels running through this underground. And so for each one you're generally going to want about a space of two blocks and then another tunnel. Now, the tunnels can be as far back as you want well the tunnels can go as deep as you want or they can just be very small and you can have it very wide all that's up to you I'm just going to show you how to set one up usually I like to go that and keep them all about the same length two three four so one two three now, one other thing that you'll need to check is if you can hit the F3 button, we'll pull up this, and on here, whew, that red means that I'm working my computer pretty hard. You can check your seed, and the number. The middle coordinate is your depth, and that is the one that we're going to want to watch, 
Diamonds show up at 32, and 64 is ground level, so we're a little above ground level. But that's alright. <coughs> Sorry about that. And so, with this, you can make it the, like, you can make a staircase going down. just set up the basic strip mine. Now go forth and create your own my minions. Happy mining.